Hello and welcome to the session. I am Deepika here. Let's discuss the question which says find the area of the circle 4x square plus 4y square is equal to 9 which is interior to the parabola x square is equal to 4y. Let us first understand how to find the area between two curves. Suppose we are given two curves that is if y is equal to fx and y is equal to gx are two curves then the area between them and the lines x is equal to a and x is equal to b is given by integral a to b f of x minus g of x dx where fx is greater than equal to gx in the closed interval ab. So this is a key idea behind our question. We will take the help of this key idea to solve the above question. So let's start the solution. First of all, we will identify the region whose area we have to find. That is, we have to find the area of the circle 4x square plus 4y square is equal to 9, which is interior to the parabola x square is equal to 4y. Now, we have 4x square plus 4y square is equal to 9. This implies x square plus y square is equal to 9 over 4 and this implies x square plus y square is equal to 3 over 2 square. Thus, It is a circle with center at the origin, that is with center 0, 0 and radius equal to 3 over 2. Now, x square is equal to 4y is a parabola with vertex at the origin that is the coordinates of the vertex are 0, 0 and symmetrical about y axis. Now we will find the points of intersection of the given two curves. Now, x square is equal to 4y implies y is equal to x square upon 4 on substituting the value of y in the equation x square plus y square is equal to 9 over 4 we get
x square plus x is to power 4 over 16 is equal to 9 over 4. This implies 16x square plus x is to power 4 is equal to 9 over 4 into 16. This implies x is to power 4 plus 16x square minus 36 is equal to 0. Now we will factorize this equation. This implies x is to power 4 plus 18x square minus 2x square minus 36 is equal to 0. And this implies x square into x square plus 18 minus 2 into x square plus 18 is equal to 0. This implies x square minus 2 into x square plus 18 is equal to 0. And this implies either x square minus 2 is equal to 0 or x square plus 18 is equal to 0. This implies either x is equal to plus minus under root of 2 or x square is equal to minus 18 which is not possible. So if x is equal to plus under root 2 then y is equal to root 2 square upon 4 which is equal to 1 over 2. Again when x is equal to minus under root of 2 then y is equal to minus under root of 2 square over 4 which is again equal to 1 over 2. Hence the points of intersection are root 2, 1 by 2 and minus root 2, 1 by 2. So this is root 2, 1 by 2 and minus root 2, 1 by 2. So we have to find the area of this shaded region. So the required area is is equal to 2 into area of the shaded region in the first quadrant and this is equal to 2 into integral 0 to root 2 y dx of circle that is minus 0 to root 2 y dx of parabola
and this is equal to 2 into integral from 0 to root 2. Now from the equation of circle we have y is equal to under root of 9 by 4 minus x square dx minus 0 to root 2. Now from the equation of parabola we have y is equal to x square upon 4 dx. Now in this part we will use the formula integral of under root of a square minus x square dx is equal to x over 2 under root of a square minus x square plus a square upon 2 sine inverse x upon a plus c. So this is equal to 2 into x by 2 into under root of 9 by 4 minus x square plus a square upon 2 which is 9 by 8 sine inverse x upon a that is 2x upon 3 and the limits are from 0 to root 2 minus 1 by 4 into x cube upon 3 and the limits are from 0 to root 2 and this is equal to 2 into root 2 over 2 into under root of 9 by 4 minus root 2 square is 2 plus 9 by 8 sine inverse 2 root 2 over 3 minus 0 upon 2 into under root of 9 by 4 minus 0 which is 0 plus 9 by 8 sine inverse 0 minus 1 by 4 into root 2 cube upon 3 minus 0 now this is equal to 2 into root 2 over 2 into 1 by 2 plus 2 into 9 over 8 sine inverse 2 root 2 over 3 minus 2 into 2 root 2 over 4 into 3 and this is equal to root 2 over 2 minus root 2 over 3 plus 2 into 9 over 8 which is 9 by 4 sine inverse 2 root 2 over 3 and this is equal to 3 root 2 minus 2 root 2 over 6 plus 9 over 4 sine inverse 2 root 2 over 3 and this is equal to root 2 over 6 plus 9 by 4 sine inverse 2 root 2 over 3. Hence the required area is is equal to root 2 over 6 plus 9 by 4 sine inverse 2 root 2 over 3. So the answer for the above question is root 2 over 6 plus 9 by 4 sine inverse 2 root 2 over 3. 
आई होप द सोल्यूशन इज क्लियर टू यू बाय एंड टेक केयर